Hello once again and today we're going to be taking a look at the Dimplex Brayford Log Stove and model number BFD20. Um, you can get this in a, I think it also has a wood effect as well if you want to get that version but this is the all black version. Um, yeah so basically I've got a choice of one or two kilowatts of heating it's got switches on the side we'll have a look at that in a minute a realistic opti flame log effect so this is based on an vintage old stove as you can see but let's have a look at the front you can't open the door the windows are plastic and that is that's wood at the top plywood um, yeah, but the most important thing, how it heats. I mean, it looks pretty good. Um, so, as I said, let's have a look at the, the side. I don't know if you can see the switches. So you can see it's, it's one switch here, on or off. So we got one, it's got one here. So if you've got it on, that's, uh, that gives you one kilo, kilowatts. That's two, it gives you two kilowatts if you've got them both down. But if you've got them both up, it will just, um, you will just see the log effect. No heating, which is a nice touch. We'll just switch it on. There we go. So, see, you can get, you get a nice log effect there. So, let's um, switch the light off so you can see it better. So, there you go. So, obviously, you can't see much, but you can certainly see... The log effect and it looks rather nice in the dark as I say you can use this without having any heat in on at all just for effect if you want to but what I do switch the light on here it looks all right when the light when the lights on so yeah so let's have a look at this setting so if we put it on um, setting one you can hear the fan come on so the heat is at the bottom there so that's where the heating comes out it's right at the bottom so it's got nothing to do with that whatsoever it's just uh, just for effect really gives it a bit of warmth so if you push the other button down now you've got two um, kilowatts of heating and believe me it does feel nice and warm it is really nice um, so how much would you expect to pay for one of these? Um, I've seen them uh, for about 120 to 200 pounds, but depending on the model, there is an R model with uh, what's known as the BFD 220R. The BFD 20R. And the R means it comes with a remote control, so you can sit on your sit in the chair and not even bother getting up. Just use the remote to turn up or down the heating. Yeah, so that they cost a little bit more, but I never paid nowhere near that price for this. I got this from a car boot sale for five pounds. <laughs> yes, you heard me correctly there. Five old pounds for this heater, which produces a lot of heat. This is a really good heater. Um, I used to have a... Um, one of those fan heaters and they make a lot of noise and obviously a little lot smaller but this don't make too this ain't all you hear is the hum but it's nothing to put you off or nothing but those fan heaters are very loud when they're next to you this is quite nice at all and the heat coming from this thing is really good oh, this will this will warm up the room in no time at all let's turn down the heat if in fact let's put it yeah put it down to one kilowatts of heat right yeah but it looks very nice um, and the cable I would say is about two meters I'll roughly say about two meters the um, actual lead to plug it in yeah but it's rather nice I think it really looks smart I think that'll look good um, if you've got one of them old fireplaces I think it would look really nice there as I say it's, none of this opens I mean it looks like it is it looks like an old stove but you know I think it looks rather nice I think it you know if you like the old cozy feel I think it 
it'll give you that cosy feel if you put it in a fireplace I think it's rather nice um, yeah so something a little bit different there just uh, just you know five quid from a boot sale can't go wrong really I'm well pleased with it so let's it you know something that costs about 120 to 160 pounds I only got paid a five I only paid five pounds for it that can't be bad at all <laughs> anyway I'm going to end this now. Thank you so much for watching. Till next time and goodbye.